Hello again and welcome hello. to September Pickups. Mm. Well, which won't be hello again if you've never watched it before, you're only watching it for the first time. Hello for the first time and not hello again if you're watching it before. Because hello he again. Said, because he said hello, I'm saying hello again now. <laughs> hello again. <laughs> <clears throat> and yeah, so uh, September's Pickups, mm. which is, uh, for a start, I'll start with the big purchase, which was a PlayStation 4 at long last, so I don't have to say in my videos, I don't own a PlayStation 4, but if I had a PlayStation 4, I would want this game, because it's good, blah, 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 blah. So no more of that, no more, no more, because I have one, so I can actually get games that I'm actually interested in. He's kind of um, got stuff piled on top of it right now. <laughs> yes, it makes, it makes it a very handy tray sort of thing, to kind of just, just balance things on top yeah. of. Um... <laughs> Well, it's basically a big box of like what balsa wood. Um, but you probably, you probably couldn't get a much more random box. It has yeah. balsa wood plaques, various building material, a light bulb, a Russell Fest arcade board, plastic card, um, and <laughs> that's about it. But yeah, yeah. <coughs> and that's what you bought the PlayStation Four for. Yes, because it's a very <laughs> handy stand for my plastic card and some such. On the plus side, I had uh, some uh, PlayStation Plus stuff, and I was stuck with that because it, I kind of had it stored up. I didn't even realise they had certain things that I really wanted. Get your man! Da 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 da. Bird, go! <laughs> <laughs> wrong theme song for the wrong show, but you can't beat yeah. the da 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 thing. It's mm. awesome. <clears throat> Not Battle of the Planets. No, bad. Sims like seven. Gun, 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 gun. Um, Cut all the big bits and make a robot explain all the good bits that happened. And one game that I've wanted to play for ages and didn't realise I had was uh, Super Broforce. Uh -huh. Cool. I just played this, I know <laughs> what he's talking about, and it's freaking awesome. And you basically play as various action heroes. You start as Ram Bro, then you unlock Command Bro, and yeah. there's just everything from Die Hard kind of to Judge Dredd to... I can't imagine it's a 2D version of like an Expendables game, but with yeah. but with film heroes, not just yeah. retired people. Do you know that they, they actually did an Expendables version called Expendabros? Uh, and it's actually, it's actually based on the, yeah. um, uh, what should we call it, or the, um, the film, movie. So you film, actually play yeah. as, like, you know, you play as uh, Stallone's character and mm. uh, Statham's character. I have no and, idea what their characters are named in it. Not a clue. Action Not a damn clue. Action yeah. hero 2, action yeah. hero 3. It's Stallone and Statham and whoever's playing the, the role because I haven't got a fucking clue. Um, I, I, I know someone that's in the Expendable films. That would be Terry. This new Old Spice Shaver is so amazing it'll shave off every hair on your face! Oh no! I'm a hair! You're about to get shaved! Oh no! Remember that time in the amusement park? It was the best day of my life. I'm sorry! Ah! Old Spice Electric Shaver! It's sharp. That's one sharp shaver! Ah! Get shaved in the face! I did. And we're back. In the room. Mm. Didn't really go anywhere in the first place. But yeah, so much fun. Yeah, they spend the uh, spend the um, bro force yeah. so much fun. Four players, two D style. It's basically oh, I would describe it as being worms crossed with contra. Yeah. Would you say that is a, that is kind of a fair? Yeah, yeah, definitely. And in the day and age of trying to make everything look eight bit as well, but this is a really fun game. It's not stupidly hard. I mean, you've got shoot, special move, and grenade, Good. and you go around and you save action heroes, when you save them, you become them. So you go from Chuck Norris to Blade to, obviously a different name, Braid, weren't it? Yeah, yeah, Braid. And um, um, Judge Dredd, as you said, and um, Chuck Norris. Damn, who were the other ones? Um, Die Hard, um, Commando, mm. um, MacGyver. The really, really MacGyver. awkward to use MacGyver. Yeah. <laughs> Which Explosive. nobody likes. Ah, they get too close. Nobody <laughs> likes. Because the problem is, all your terrain is destructible. That's the yeah. thing. 
all the terrain is destructible. Well, you can basically destroy the whole thing and not be able to make any progress forwards. Yeah. You know, it's, it's um, fun game. Really, really cool. I've never heard of it until tonight. And he said, there you go, pad, play, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> and awesome. As I tend to do. Mm. They really did with another game as well. <laughs> yes, which is my next one, mm. uh, which is on my PS4 again. And it was... It wasn't the reason I bought a PS4, but it kind of gave me a reason to, to get one, if you know what I mean. It's not the sole reason, but you know. And that is, it's very, very nice to actually have an English copy of this. Yes, Switch, a right? PAL version, a full-on PAL UK version. Gundam yeah. Versus, which is weird because it's not like Extreme Versus, Full Boost, Aeon Flux, Hyper Championship, Street Fighter, Turbo, Mini. Rebout. Ultimate match, dream match, rebirth. thing. Yeah, rebirth, <laughs> unlimited force. Yeah, that one. Um, Version point two one. <laughs> <laughs> five. Um, B. <laughs> subsection C. And we're going on for <laughs> Yes, but there should be games playing there. Yeah. You know? yes. No, Gundams, killing things. Yes, and versusness and goodness. Yes. And uh, this one's cool because it's it's very virtual on, but it's not virtual on. I said Marrow. Marrow is a fucking Marvel character. <laughs> Apparently, I haven't met the most annoying Harrows yet, so. Yes, you've got to watch the original series of Gundam to get the most annoying Just finished And Zeta as well. Good series, but meh ending. He didn't die. That's there's ma there's many, know. many mere things about Destiny, though, yes. isn't there? Mm. It's, um, but because Seed's, I think Seed's really good. Mm. And Destiny Definitely. drags Seed down. Seed all the way through is top notch. Yeah. And I, I think that Seed gets a bad rep because of Destiny, I mm. personally think. So. Um, Silly decisions in Destiny is Seed. Yes. Or Seed Destiny. Uh, isn't it? And, and luckily, the game. there's no Seed Destiny in this. Uh, there is only Seed. Mm. Um, there's a lot of series in this. They've added a lot of new suits to this compared to Gunland vs. Full Boost. And they've taken... Oh, Stream vs. Full Boost, sorry. Um, we're back to that again. <laughs> but it's the... Um, it's just the fact that they've added so many and taken so many away. That's weird. I mean, there's certain ones I really want to use. I, I want to use the um, War in the Pocket characters. I want the Alex and I want Bernie Zaku. Um, I love those two. They're not very good, but I love them because I love the series and I want to hear the nice music play and I kind of like go into battle and stuff. And it's good. And I like it. Kind of like hearing the um, Gatchaman theme playing when you pick a Gatchaman character in the Japanese version of Tatsunoko versus. Oh, that, that's so hype. With yeah. all the characters, though, yeah. it's, it's so yeah. hype when oh, the actual yeah. theme starts playing. Like, yeah. da 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 and they took it out for the UK version. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> because no one know, knows what the, the theme is in this country. Apart uh, from us. Yeah. And probably Anyone two else? Two people. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I played it for the first time properly. I played them before on the PS3, didn't I? Cause yeah, very briefly. It's very, very briefly. But you actually sat down and played it yeah. properly this time. You yeah. played it like about... I played through a whole... Section. Six rounds, yeah. whatever it was. Yeah. It? it really good. I mean, it took me a few levels to get into it. Like it does at any game, so I'd really played it properly before. But when I knew what I was doing... Mm which doesn't happen very often. <laughs> it was really good. It was, yeah, I can, I'm, I've said to you, I'm going to get that when it's 15 quid near Christmas. <laughs> or it'll go the other way and it'll be like 60 bloody quid everywhere and CEX will be paying like 30 for it and it'll be like a thousand pounds or something. <laughs> oh, yes. yes. But yeah. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. I don't know. No. <laughs> um. Yes, but I really, really enjoy playing the... Um, 20 minutes or so that I played it, and I picked some characters that I knew. A Harrow, he kept pointing out the Harrow being annoying in the background. I was like, listen, you were fine, you were fine until I started pointing it out. Stop it. But the Harrow's there, you were like, oh no. And they are really irritating. <laughs> really irritating. Yeah, they whine in Japanese, and on like the right side of the screen, it comes up what they're actually saying, but you can't see it because you're busy playing the actual game. You can't. You haven't got time, even in the slightest, to look over to see what no. the hell this Harrow's saying. Too much going on. So hopefully there's a mode of way to turn that thing off, because it's really fucking irritating. Like, really, really yeah. irritating. Oh. So um, hopefully I can mm. turn it off. But yes, my first impressions were really, really good. Yeah, I've played it a bit. I've not played it that much. I've played through about... I used to play it on trial mode, and I played mm. through the first four or five trials, whatever it is, so about 20-odd 
rounds or 30 rounds or whatever it is, something like that. Um, I play a couple of them through twice sort of thing with different suits, just unlocking different things and stuff. And yeah, it was really, really good and very enjoyable. I've not tried to play it online yet because I get annihilated. <laughs> um, the expert, experts from Asia take over. Yes. Yes, it's a worldwide server, so um, <laughs> that scares me. Because then uh, people like, literally just play the one game yes. all the time. Yes, it's um, yes, and that scares me. That scares me very Thumbs much. Up. Brilliant game. Awesome. Game. To get the list. Right, a game that is weird because I kind of got it at the same time as getting the PS4, and therefore <laughs> was going to sort of end up playing this instead of playing on the PS4 anyway, and that is. Mass Effect Andromeda. Um, finally got it cheap. Um, mm. I'm still undecided. I'm only about two hours in. I still haven't got bit by it yet, if you know what I mean. I'm not sort of into it. I'm sort of playing it and I'm like, meh, why am I doing this? Why am I doing that? Why am I doing this? I'm not invested or interested or... Mm. Or anything yet. Paige says it did, does. It doesn't grab you like the other ones, but she had to do everything. She's done pretty much yeah, everything yeah, in it now. Yeah. But it just doesn't grab you by the collars like the other games. And you're like, yeah, let's go and do these missions. Yeah. This one yeah. is kind of like, yeah, let's let's pop around and do this mission. Yeah, go it's because it's because it sort of resets everything and it resets the universe yeah. and stuff. It kind of, I don't know. It just feels very awkward. You just don't feel part of it. Like if if, if you just literally started as Shepherd. Mm. Continuing a shepherd from somewhere or something, it'd just be like, "Yeah, I'm shepherd," shepherd. you know, and just go, <laughs> just go through, you know, basically um, saying about everywhere being your favourite place on the Citadel, mm -hmm. and punching reporters, mm -hmm. so. and buying spaceships. Yes, <laughs> the little, little toy ones that go in your office with your, your fish that are probably dead, you know. <laughs> uh, so. and your space hamster. <laughs> Which is a reference to um, another uh, Bioware game, that is. Um, Miri the Space Hamster, that is. Um, Miri the Hamster was from uh, Baldur's Gate. Ah, oh, right. Yeah, it was like, there's also, there's a couple of comments like that, like um, Tally like, puts out a drone and she's going, go for the optics, Miri, go for the optics. Mm. Well, what, the, what this guy says to his hamster is, go for the eyes, Miri, go for the eyes. Yeah, uses right, another reference. So it, there's, there's lots of little in, in jokes, in references, and stuff, and stuff to Bowers Gate. Mm. Is it Bowers Gate? No, it's not. Is it Bowers Bar Bar Gate the other one? I can't remember. It's been a long, long, long time. <clears throat> if he does remember, subtitles. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a feeling it was Never Winter Nights, actually, who I think, well, what I'm actually <laughs> thinking of, but never mind. It's a long, long time ago. Mm. Um, and the last one, which is uh, one thanks to Cliff, which is new and sealed and probably will never be opened. <laughs> I've had this for like two years, new and sealed, and I know he was like more invested in than me, and we did like a tradey swap. Either. Yes, um, it is in the Zuma Eleven, the first one on the Nintendo DS, not the 3DS, the DS. Not um, the DS, but it can be played on the DS and the 3DS. <laughs> yes, but on the 4DS because it's not out yet. Uh, that's, that's a switch. That's a switch of 4DS. Yeah. Uh, yeah, true. <laughs> but yeah, um, strange is, is the best way of describing this game. I think the main thing is the second one's better because this is this is like a football Pokemon RPG thing with touchscreen football and Shaolin soccer moves. It's bonkers. And the second one's the most bonkers of all of them because you basically have to save the world from aliens by playing soccer. So, yeah. I'd be you know, for that. Yeah, a bit of footy to tackle the aliens and stuff with. It's, uh, yeah, that, that, that's just an awesome, awesome, awesome premise. And then it went back to normal after that. It was normal before it. But the second one's just super bonkers and it's probably the best one. Um, Is it more than two then? Yeah, there's, mm. uh, I think there's three or four. And there's one on the 3DS at least. I think there's two on the 3DS. Mm. I think there's one last one. You know, one in the one that's like, like the Pokemon has one version in one game and one version. That's two. two that's from two. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. This is the only version that's not like that. Oh, right. The okay. first one's the only game that doesn't have two versions, like a fire red and a leaf green sort of thing. It's the only version that doesn't have mm. that. Um, 
it's just vanilla and that's it but it's really bonkers and it looks so enjoyable I'm not even that into footy but it just looks so enjoyable and anime and bonkers and batshit crazy that I just got to play it you know I'm man, man. you've got like you know you got like sort of typical like evil villains like the very <laughs> sort of I don't know Team Rocket-esque and yeah. the whole thing just looks really 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 bonkers and I just want to play it so it looks good so you go around the world playing football <laughs> yes now the thing is though there's over a thousand players <clears throat> you can recruit fucking hell so that's a big game got to collect them all mm. so uh, no, that, they have they released little figures for them, little, little teddy bears that you could buy in shops. And... <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that would be. Well, wouldn't surprise me if they did that. To be honest, uh, so yeah, that is it for me for September. Indeed. So um, as always, uh, if you saw what you, if you like, saw what you liked, then <laughs> say yeah, I like that. That was good. I saw it the mm. other day. It was fun. It didn't have anything to do with you, but it was good. Yeah. Maybe a squirrel just sliding his nuts or something like that. Yes. Yeah, anything. Anything uh, that looks nice. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> <but> <laughs> Almost anything. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so, yeah, as always, if you uh, like what you've seen, please uh, like and uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed and press that stupid little bell that they've put there as well it's really you'll really get notifications of all like, yeah, of our videos there, so. but still wait for christmas it's getting closer yay take care Boo. <laughs>i am repaired. <laughs> Detoy boxed. Yeah. I'm looking spiffy. Spiffy, spiffy, spiffy. Looking all nice and fresh, ready for the party. The party? All his friends will be jealous of his new paint job. And the party? Mm. <laughs> I am singing at the party. I made the party, it's my turn to sing at the party. Everyone's singing happy party. It's my party and I cry if I want to. <laughs> well, I was actually doing Nacho Libre. It's like yeah, one of the, I knew it was a it's one of the few one. bits I actually really, really yeah. like in that film. Um, it's, it's like an equal blend of rubbish and awesome. It's really strange, Nacho Libre. <clears throat> but anyways.